Wake up and move. Justin Arnold back here again at Flex MP for another Movement Monday. And this is Dragonflies or Dragonfly Negatives. If you're not sure what that is, it's one of my favorite core moves. Now it is a little more advanced, but we're gonna go through various progressions today. So this could be a move everyone can do, at least some version. So don't let set any limitations. Come and try this, or at least one of the variations we show, and progress through it, and you'll just feel that ab shredding, six pack giving, great midsection move again to get you moving better, feeling better, and living better today at Flex MP. Okay, so we'll go through uh, one of the more advanced versions of it. Uh, and then we'll kind of show you some variations that you could try at home or at the gym. And I have a bench, but you don't need anything. Uh, you could literally lay on the ground and grab something like a rig or whatever behind you. Uh, I wouldn't really grab a person. You could, but uh, you want something sturdy. So anyways, here we go. So just get that bench. <laughs> Let's take that off. You're just gonna grab the end of it. I like to start here to make sure I'm active. Make sure you warm up too, because this is more advanced. You don't want to just go right into it like some people might hollow hold or a plank. Make sure we're not arching in the back. So you want to like make sure you're squeezing there in the abs. It helps to kind of start up and then kind of go up here like a candlestick. So again, almost straight up if you can. Do the, if you need to use a little momentum, totally cool. And, and so then we'll go from there. So that's like one rep of a negative. More advanced, you may not even touch the butt, just come straight leg up. Uh, but that's basically what it is. From there, we're gonna kinda go almost in reverse order. So say you're not quite there, one way is you bring the knees in, do like this negative, control, control, control. When you start to feel break, maybe drop the butt and then come back knee in. Could be there. You could also start from the bottom. So, and then do almost like a pulse up, drop the butt, and then lower. Again, make sure it's coming from the abs. Feel an arch, then maybe knee, pulse up, drop the butt, go slow. Really working the negative of this one, the way down, really slowly will really help you on this maneuver. So there we go, we got those. And then you could even just, do some of these kickouts. That might be where you're at. And that might be hard enough. From there, if that's too hard, you go single leg, single leg, single leg. And you can kind of combine. So that's kind of the bottom. Then the top is just straighten the legs out. If your hamstring is a little tight like my leg right now, that's fine. Hey, you just do some pulse ups. Make sure you're going almost as straight up as you can. Try not to go like too far back here. Try not to go using too much momentum and then going down, because then you'll start to use your low back. That one could be 10 to 20 reps where you do. Where like the, the, uh, the uh, dragonflies, you may be starting out with like six to 10. One other variation that I almost forgot is a single leg. So this might become more in the middle if you've got those last two. So again, you could start up like this, and then working one leg at a time, again, bring the knee in. You, when you do these, no matter what you feel, definitely gonna feel a lot of the lower abdominals. You're definitely feeling the mid middle. All of this is working. You'll feel the connection though in between your hips, your abs, you'll feel the back, but make sure you're, it's not detrimental if you're feeling too much low back or hip. You might not have the core strength for wherever you're at on progressions, or you might just be fatiguing. So just listen to your body on this one. Going slow, breathing, bracing of course, and just kind of being connected to the whole thing will make you move better. So let me show that one. That's actually one I really like to come back to. And this eventually could be a warm up for those going for the more advanced. And then back up, keep this here, try to keep it straight. So I'm squeezing my quad, squeezing my glute. If you can, point your toe. <sighs> That might be where a lot of you are at on this movement. And give yourself proper rest. I did it in a circuit today, so just that might be another way you do, do it. And then again, when you're ready. Uh, 
And then if you're not there, remember the negative. <laughs> so there you go. There's some of your progressions of the dragonfly negative, the dragonflies. We got some single leg. We did some knee tucks. Shoo, let me scoot over. Did some pulse ups. Plenty of variations over there. Don't do them all one day. Maybe three to four sets, depending on the rep range. Could be anywhere from six to 20 with those leg pulses. But if you need more help, more direction, more guidance, give us a call, give us a text, reach out on our emails, on our website, social media, wherever, because we're happy to help you because we want to see you guys move better because then you'll feel better. And when you feel better, we're all going to live that better life. So thanks for tuning in this one. Hope you end up giving it a try, at least some version. Thank me for me later. <laughs> thank yourself, thank your body. Uh, it's definitely one of control and patience. So get that one in with this one as well. Anyways, thanks for tuning in guys. Have a blessed week. Take care, peace and love. Hey, thanks for checking out videos just like these. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe and click on notifications below to stay up to date all these videos that we post here throughout the week. And again, tag a friend underneath if you think they might benefit from these videos. And if you need further training or further information or a little more personalized programming to meet your needs, we can create a customized roadmap to meet your needs here at FlexMP. Just click on that link below. Again, contact us today at FlexMP to get you moving better, living better, and feeling better.